Well, if that works, I'll be mightily impressed actually, because this is one hell of a contraption I've got in my arm and I definitely need two hands to support it for any period of time, I would say. Um, but basically what I've got here is, uh, if I can pan that down, you will see that I have the Rode Filmmaker Lavalier going into wireless thing clip to be belt. And then in my hand, in this here Osmo rig, I've got, you can probably see it if I swing it around far enough. Yeah, probably see bits of it, no, maybe not. Let's have a look. Oops, other way. There we go, there's the back of the phone. And you can see the <laughs> Tascam TR40 underneath. Uh, that's mounted on to a, um, what am I doing? There we go, that's better. That's mount I know it's overexposed at the back. I can see it on the zebras. Um, that's life, deal with it. Um, you saw the Tascam mounted there on the sort of extension arm thing the, uh, for the Osmo. Well, underneath, <laughs> I've got the uh, receiver for the wireless lav under there. So, I mean, this isn't too bad because I've potentially got space for another XLR as well. Um, but anyway, this is really all about just seeing if it's usable. Tell you what we'll do as well. I'll show Matt, there's my camera. Yeah, this is really all about just seeing if the bloody workflow is usable. I think it probably will be. But I need to find somewhere balancing this rig a bit. It's not, it is heavy with the Tascam and the receiver and the phone and everything hanging off one side of it. The issue is more, is more really that it's, um, it's unbalanced. So, but if I hold it by the receiver, that seems to work okay. Yeah. So let's see if it worked. 